Good morning, church. Welcome to your daily devotion. I'm Tim, uh, part of our Geneva campus. And this morning we'll be starting with uh, Mark 5, verse 34. Um, and Jesus is talking to the woman with the issue of blood. And he says in verse 34, Daughter, your faith has healed you. Go in peace and be freed from your suffering. We've been in a series talking about miracles and faith. And we had our month of prayer and fasting recently. Um, and as we are, we're all inspired to believe in the in the, the build up to a miracle and and take steps of faith in that, but I think it's important for us to look at what Jesus commands after the miracle, which with this lady was, go in peace and be freed from your suffering. It also says in verse twenty nine, immediately her bleeding stopped and she felt in her body that she was freed from suffering. Part of the miracle in this story is the is the freedom and peace that God gives with it, and I think sometimes we 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 can forget that and move straight on to the next thing. So I think it's important for us to acknowledge God, uh, acknowledge the the freedom and peace that He's given us, um, and 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 use use that for His good. So in Isaiah sixty two verse twelve, um, God is talking about His people, and He says they will be called the holy people and the redeemed people by the Lord. And Jerusalem will be known as the desirable place and the city no longer forsaken. Um, so we are God's people and he wants us to be known as the desirable place. And I, and I believe that us living, living it, in our current society that's like so fast paced and everything happens in an instant, us living with peace and uh, a real, I guess like a real honest, freedom where where we will where we're in it, uh, people of integrity and with people that can be trusted but I, I think those characteristics that that God gives with a miracle um what speak volumes to people so my prayer for you today is that um we're able to acknowledge God for the miracle that's already been and that in the aftermath that our, the freedom and the peace that God has given us can be a testimony to those around us. Thanks very much. Have a great day.